An Israeli startup is creating groundbreaking drugs to treat solid tumor cancers. Silent Seed's revolutionary medicine can help curb pancreatic, prostate, and brain cancer. Dr. Amot Shemi is the CEO and co-founder of Silent Seed, and he joins us with more. Thanks for coming in. Pleased to be here, Natasha. So talk to us a little bit about Silent Seed. What does your company do? And your company has a very interesting name. I'd like to hear more about that. Right, so we are focusing on treating cancer, specifically solid tumors, and even more specifically pancreatic cancer. And the whole idea is to combine new drug with new way of deliver the drug directly to the tumor. And your name, why, why, where do you get this name, Salin Seed? It is very important related to the technology which generally called RNA interference, and specifically you silence gene, the specific gene that cause the specific cancer. So the name comes from silencing seed. We are putting a seed, a capsule, within the tumor, and this uh, seed sheds the drug along four months. Wow. So your startup deals not only with the drug, but the process in which the drug goes into the tumor. Can you talk to us about that? Yes. Uh, you know, this technology of RNA interference is existing about 16 years, but it is very difficult to really deliver the, the drug all the way to the target tumor. So we did develop a new capsule that sheds the drug within the tumor and shields the drug before sending the drug to the, to the cells along four months. And this comes to, seems to be very effective. We treated, uh, uh, we did many preclinical studies and then we moved to treat patients in clinical study in phase one in Israel. Is your invention meant to cure cancer or to simply improve or prolong the life of people who have cancer? Right, you know, it's a, it's a long way to cure, uh, specifically pancreatic cancer, which uh, is very tough uh, uh, cancer. You want to extend the life, you want to improve the life, and to subgroups who even have the hope to fully cure. As you said before, you've already passed the first stage of your research here in Israel. What were the results of the testing that you did? Very encouraging. Uh, the study initially st uh, was focused only on the first two months to do uh, studies and to, t to take parameters of safety. But practically, it was extended to two years. We treated only once. We should treat every four months. But in this specific study, we, we treated only one, and day one, and we follow up the, the patients. So it sounds that it, it seems that it is very safe. We shed very, very little amount of uh, drug. And also, you can tell some very encouraging efficacy results, like halting the tumor, halting the time that metastases are spread, and extending the life. So these are huge findings. What are the next steps in, in this process? Right. Next step, uh, we are now building our facility in Modin uh, to be able to manufacture these capsules, these seeds that I mentioned. And we are applying to the FDA, to the Food and Drug Administration, with a target to do a full-scale phase two uh, study in the um, United States. And from then to take it to Israel and to Europe as well. So your startup is just one of many Israeli startups that's changing the world. Why did you guys choose to, to focus on pancreatic and prostate and brain cancer specifically? Yeah, so this technology called RNAi, uh, if you identify a specific gene, uh, it helps. And in pancreatic cancer specifically, there is a um, gene called Keras, which practically all the patients uh, have a mutated keras, so you can design a specific drug to, towards a specific uh, uh, gene. That's one reason. Second reason is it is really unmet need. And the market is large. Unfortunately, the number of prevalence, number of new patients just growing very fast. Uh, so it is both biologically, technology, and also business-wise uh, decision to, to start with pancreatic cancer. So patients who have different types of cancers, can they be optimistic about the research that you're doing right now? Absolutely, but it will take time. Absolutely. Every solid tumors, and you can mention, you mentioned prostate, you mentioned the glioblastoma brain cancer, also breast cancer, and other solid tumors. The, the platform is there. It is now clinically approved. 
uh, but it takes time to, you know, to tune it to a specific cancer. Well, congratulations on the medical breakthrough that you guys are making right now, and I'm excited to see uh, where this goes. I hope. Thank you very much.